started like I was saying about 20 years back when uh, uh, we focused on uh, when I was studying in college and they focused uh, DARPA was released a project saying that can we drive an autonomous vehicle across the desert without any human intervention um, and I think that is my association with that project made me realize one thing one simple rule um, that uh, uh, human beings cannot really fight with AI right I think we have to and today today I would say it is somewhere a reality right somewhere uh, but somewhere a reality that we are realizing that uh, uh, AI can only fight with AI right it's not really something it is humanly not possible whereas human beings can also launch AI which can repel some of the effects that we are facing today from AI itself um, so that was the simple rule uh, we built platforms on for the last 20 years uh, maybe in the last four years when we were looking at defense systems and Indrajal was born um, we were also answering this very simple question saying that tomorrow if an enemy, enemy throws uh, intelligent weapons at us uh, how are we going to protect ourselves it's not, it's not something that existing systems can do so we have to bring in autonomous systems and a race of autonomous systems to do that um, and that's what I think Indrajal marks the first uh, one of those systems where we are able to use uh, some le uh, level of autonomy uh, that is not seen before um, and then second of all I would say uh, I think one of the things uh, fundamentally uh, challenging um, is that we think that I think uh, we have been kind to jammers and laser weapons but I really think um, when it comes down to drones only intelligent counter drones can can truly uh, can be a true countermeasure because when it comes to cost when it comes to time and the response time that we are looking at it is just impossible to do any other countermeasure which is uh, highly expensive and engaging in a serial format um, and I think that was the uh, the core vision when we built Indrajal saying that only AI can beat AI right so it's not the uh, the, the sensors and the weapons and all of these yes they're all important but under underlying there has to be um, an AI engine that can drive these uh, sensors and weapons to success um, and that's what the vision is and uh, today is uh, our first stepping stone for that thank you everyone for being here